time to re retest the second Harbor Freight front. The first one failed after 38 days of use. So that was a fail. I thought it was going to be the battery, but it turned out to be a pump. I took it back to Harbor Freight this morning. You could see the date on the receipt that I got refunded back. They did it under warranty. So this is the brand new replacement. So we're going to retest and today is going to be the start of day one. I'm going to run this pump once a day, either evacuating out refrigerant tanks or on a car. Um, because it takes so long to charge up the battery, it's not worth using in a shop environment where you have production, multiple cars or nothing like that. So definitely not recommended. If you're trying to make money, this is not the pump to use. Uh, but for our emergency pump or for use it little things like I use it, I could drive from one location to another location vacuuming out. I could hook up a vacuum line and hook up one of my refrigerant uh, gauges and I can vacuum and dry out and clean the gauges after I use them on a vehicle between driving and shops. So it would be good for something like that in my car once a day and then recharge the battery and then use it again the next day. And so we'll try to see if this lasts more than 38 days like the vac last vacuum pump and we'll give this little uh, pump a tryout. Uh, somebody told me Makita batteries work on it. This is a Makita battery. I can tell you it doesn't work. Uh, definitely I wish my Milwaukee 12 amp, oh, this is the 9. I have some 12 amp batteries. I would love if those would work, but those don't work. So you're invested not only in a pump, but a charger and multiple batteries. Um, most everybody has Milwaukee or Makita or DeWalt, which it's too bad. I gotta find an adapter to make this worthwhile because a 5 amp battery is only enough for one hour only and I think I need more like a 12 amp battery to not worry about walking away from it. So let's start our test today. I'll see you guys later and I'll tell you when this thing fails again. See ya.